Welcome to Friesen's online tutorial series. My name is Catherine and this session will focus on creating a two-page template using InDesign CS4. We're going to start by clicking on File, New Document, and we want two facing pages letter size. And for our margins, we want the top to be two. The inside can be either set at one or two picas if you want some more room down your spine. The bottom is four and the outside stays at three. We're going to add a one pica bleed line around the outside of our two pages by selecting more options. And once you click on OK, you'll notice that your two pages don't come up right away. You'll only see one page. And so to correct this, we're going to go to Layout, Numbering and Section Options. And we're going to start our page numbering at 500. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to go to swatches and we're going to delete all the pre-created color swatches except for none, paper, black and registration. So just select all the colors and click on the little trash can to delete them. The next window we're going to go to is character located on the side menu or under type at the top. We're going to go to the flyout menu and we're going to turn ligatures off by clicking on it. Now we're going to add some page numbers. So we're going to go up to the pages and we're going to double click on our A master and we're going to start by dragging some guides from our rulers on the side and top. And the placement of these is going to be one pica outside of our margins. Now we can go ahead and we can click on the T tool and we can use this to create our text box. So you just want to click and drag. And now to insert our page number, we're going to go to the type menu on the top. And scroll down to insert special character marker current page number and because we're on the master pages this will be A. Now highlight that A and what we're going to do now is we're going to change the size and we're going to change the font And now what we want to do is we want to select our text box using our selection tool and we want to copy and paste. And we want to move this to our right hand page and we're going to highlight our text
and we're going to make sure that it is right aligned. Now we're going to go back to our two pages, so just double click on them, and you'll notice that we have page numbers now, 500 and 501. So we're going to save. So if we're going to go to File, Save As. And we're going to save this in our yearbook folder. In Templates. And we're going to save this as a two-page template. And the Save As type, we want to select Template. This concludes our session on creating a two-page template. If you have any questions, please contact your Friesen's representative. If you would like some more options for customizing your template, please see our other tutorials.